Welcome to Tally Learning Hub. In this session, you will learn how to maintain optimum stock levels using reorder level in Tally Prime. Using the reorder level feature in Tally Prime, you can quickly get to know the shortfall and stock that needs to be refilled. As a result, you can eliminate the risk of overstocking and understocking. To begin with, let's learn how to set the reorder level in Tally Prime. From Gateway of Tally, select Alter, type Reorder. Select Reorder Level, Stock Group. You can select all items if you wish to do it for all stock items. Select the group. Here, Reorder Quantity is a minimum stock level you expect to maintain constantly and Minimum Quantity is the lowest quantity of stock that you would wish to order. Let's mention the reorder and minimum quantity. Likewise, let's mention the details for other stock items. Enter and accept the screen. That's it. You are done with setting reorder level details. Now, based on your inwards, outwards and order committed or placed, Tally Prime will show you the reorder status in a real time. Press escape and go back to gateway of Tally. To view the report, Press Alt plus G for Go To. Type Reorder. Select Stock Group Reorder Status. Select the Stock Group. Now, you can quickly get to know the products with a shortfall and the quantity for placing the order. Here is a quick tip. The net available stock is arrived at by considering the closing stock plus purchase order placed reduced by the sales order. Next. Let's learn how to use advanced parameters that will be useful when the consumption pattern fluctuates too frequently. Let's go back to reorder level configuration screen by pressing Alt plus G for go to. Alter master. Type and select reorder level. Select the stock group. Press Alt plus S for advanced reorder. Now, you have another dimension to arrive at the reorder level based on your past months, years, weeks or days consumption pattern. Let's say you want to arrive at the shortfall based on the past 15 days total consumption or the fixed reorder quantity, whichever is higher. First, let's mention the fixed reorder quantity. Under advanced parameters, mention 15 and select days. Next, select criteria as higher. Similarly, you can activate advanced parameters for minimum order quantity by pressing Alt plus V. Mention fixed minimum order quantity and the consumption criteria for minimum order quantity. Press Enter and accept the screen. Press Escape and go back to the report. Press F4 to change the stock group for which you want to see the report. Now, the report will calculate the reorder details considering the consumption pattern. That's it. A simple one-time configuration will help you maintain optimum stock levels. Here is a quick recap of things we learned in this session. Configuring reorder and minimum order details. Reorder status report to know the shortfall and quantity that needs to be ordered. Using advanced parameters that consider the consumption details.